Hello, I'm Aman, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Northern Virginia. Today, I'm going to show you a few ways to deal with an issue when your Amazon Elastic Compute Cloud instance is stuck in the stopping state. Let's get started. If your instance appears to be stuck in the stopping state, there might be an issue with the underlying host hardware. In such a situation, you can attempt to recover the EC2 instance either by performing a force stop or by launching a replacement instance. You can force stop the EC2 instance using either the AWS Management Console or the AWS command line interface. Follow these steps to force stop the EC2 instance using the AWS Management Console. Log in to the AWS Management Console and navigate to the EC2 console. In the navigation pane, choose Instances and select the stuck instance. Choose Instance State, force stop the instance, stop. To force stop the instance using the AWS CLI, use the stop instances command and the dash dash force option like this. This forces the instance to stop within a few minutes. You can then restart the EC2 instance. You can create a replacement instance. You can create an Amazon machine image of the stuck instance and launch a new instance using the new AMI. To create a replacement instance using this option in the AWS Management Console, open the AWS Management Console and navigate to the EC2 console. In the navigation pane, choose Instances and select the stuck instance. Choose Actions, Image and Templates, Create Image. On the Create Image page, do the following. Enter a name and description for the AMI. Choose No Reboot. Choose Create Image. Launch a new instance from the AMI. Verify that the new instance is working as expected. If you can't create an AMI from the instance as described in the previous procedure, you can set up a replacement instance using an alternate approach. Select the instance and choose Storage, Block Devices. Select each volume and note its volume ID. Be sure to note which volume is the root volume. In the navigation pane, choose Volumes. Select each volume for the instance and choose Actions, Create Snapshot. In the navigation pane, choose Snapshots. Select the snapshot that you just created and choose Actions, Create Volume. Launch an instance with the same operating system as the stuck instance. Note the volume ID and device name of its root volume. Choose Instance State, Stop Instance. In the navigation pane, choose Volumes. Select the root volume of the stopped instance and choose Actions, Detach Volume. Select the root volume that you created from the stuck instance. Choose Actions, Attach Volume. Attach it to the new instance as its root volume using the device name that you noted earlier. Similarly, attach any additional non-root volumes to the instance. In the navigation pane, choose Instances and select the replacement instance. Choose Instance State, Start Instance. Verify that the instance is working as expected. To terminate the stuck instance after launching the replacement instance using one of these two methods, select the stuck instance, choose Instance State, Terminate Instance. If the instance also gets stuck terminating, Amazon EC2 automatically forces it to terminate within a few hours. These are a few ways to deal with an EC2 instance stuck in the stopping state. 
Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.